If you've been walking or running a lot, you might be noticing some tension or some tightness or even some pain in your feet, your shins, or your calves. Your feet are your foundation. So it's really, really important to take care of your feet. I personally have been walking a lot more during quarantine with my family. We're trying to get our 10,000 steps a day. And um, because, uh, because of all the walking, I'm noticing actually my plantar fasciitis that I had maybe 14 years ago is coming back. And I think it's a combination of a couple things. I think it's increased walking. I think it's um, not rolling my feet enough and not as many calf stretches that um, I used to be getting in the alkaline studio. So what I would recommend is a couple things. One, check your footwear, make sure that you've got support in your footwear. Two, um, definitely roll your feet, but not just the feet. Your body is a system of systems. So roll your feet, your calves and your shins, and also uh, make sure that you are stretching. Uh, plantar fasciitis is directly correlated with tight calves, so it's really important that you're um, stretching your calves. You can do that with like laying down with a yoga strap over the ball of your feet, getting hamstrings, calves, and the bottom of your feet. You can put the um, ball of your foot on a step and drop your heel below the step. We do this a lot at Alkaline by putting the ball of the foot on a yoga block and then letting the heel drop below. Um, all really good ways to maintain flexibility and mobility in your feet. Of course, also practicing strengthening exercises is really important. That's why at Alkaline, we do not wear shoes because we want your um, feet at least temporarily out of that supportive footwear so they can actually work to strengthen those muscles that support your whole system. So if you've been walking or running a lot and you're noticing anything going on with your feet, I cannot emphasize enough to get ahead of it. It is really, really hard to get rid of something like plantar fasciitis once it comes on. So definitely be proactive, get to the rolling and the stretching as soon as possible.